today we're going to be interviewing some of the nominees, amazing nominees, for the Outstanding Teacher Award. So let's get to it. I think I know you. You do? How is that? I think I might be in your class. Are you in my sixth grade class this year? I, I never knew. So. Oh my gosh. Hi. Hi. <laughs> okay, great. Um, I'm How do you feel about getting it? Oh, I'm excited because, you know, it just shows that I'm actually doing something that actually helps my students and impacts their daily lives. Why did you be want to become a teacher? I've always wanted to be a teacher. I actually, when I was little, I would play teacher with my, my neighborhood friends and I would ask the teachers for extra work to take home to make my neighbors do all the homework. Wow, that is a very interesting story you <laughs> have there. So, did you know that when you wanted to become a teacher, that you would get a nominee for the Outstanding Teacher Award? I never imagined it in my life. It's a great honor. Our class can get a little crazy sometimes, so what do you do to calm down? So I actually help use a lot of humor in my daily life, and so I do this laughing it off. It helps me calm it down. And then I go home and I just sit on the couch and I play games on my phone like everybody else. <laughs> great joke. Hi, I'm Nate, and I'm back here with another nominee for the Outstanding Teacher Award. Somehow I got here super fast, I don't know how, but it helps for the new show timing. And I'm going to be asking some questions. Is, um, how do you feel about this award? I think it was really an honor to be nominated, and I think that there are so many outstanding teachers in the school that it's hard to be singled out, but I think it, um, it was really nice that I was nominated. Mm -hmm. Why did you want to become an English as a second language teacher? I've been teaching a really long time. Um, and I was a classroom teacher for many, many years. Um, I taught kindergarten and first grade. But when I, I, I started teaching in Florida, and in Florida, you had to take the classes to because um, there were so many second language learner, learners. and. Um, as soon as I took the classes, I knew that when I moved to Virginia, that's what I wanted to do. Although I didn't do it right away. I've been doing this for about 15 years in this county. And um, I really enjoy meeting the new kids and learning with, the, um, learning with them. That sounds great. Well, why, what's the best part of your job? The best part of my job is working with so many different classroom teachers and so many different grade level students. I work from kindergarten all the way up to sixth grade and that I get to meet all different ages of students and um, I work with many teachers, so that's the best part. Well, that sounds like a great job. <laughs> this is Nate signing off from our outstanding teachers. Goodbye. Hi, I'm Tessa and I'm here with Ms. Milstein and we're gonna do a jam session. Thanksgiving. Ms. Milstein, what do you think about Thanksgiving? I love Thanksgiving. I love it so much. I wrote a song about it. Would you like to join me? Of course. Awesome. Love to eat turkey cause it's good. Eat that turkey like good kids should cause it's turkey to eat. So good. Turkey for me, turkey for you. The pilgrims ate turkey wearing fancy shoes. I love that turkey at the table. Don't forget to invite your grandma Mabel. Eat that turkey all night long. Isn't this the most amazing Thanksgiving song? Turkey lurkey do and turkey lurkey nap. I eat that turkey then I take a nap. Thanksgiving. We all need to have a break. That means we don't have to see Mr. Hirsch or Mrs. Drake. That's right. Turkey with gravy and cranberry. Last year I taught fifth grade with Mrs. Berry. Turkey for you and turkey for me. I ate so much turkey, now I need some P.E. Turkey for the girls and turkey for the boys. My favorite kind of pants are corduroys. Gobble, gobble, goop, and gobble, gobble, giggle. I wish that turkey only cost a nickel. 
Oh, I love Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Happy Thanksgiving.